When it comes to social media, things can get a bit fuzzy. That's why the Verify team is here to bring things back into view. Today we're talking about moments like this. When fumes filled the streets in places like Washington, D.C. And soon after, tweets like this. Do not wear contacts to any protest, one person wrote. When exposed with tear gas, your contacts will burn and glue to your eyes, causing you to become permanently blind. So let's verify. Can fumes like tear gas blind you if you wear contacts? No more increased risk for blindness at all. Helping us out with this one is Dr. Lyndon Jones, the director of the Center for Ocular Research and Education at the University of Waterloo. The contact lenses don't get glued to your eye. That's actually physically impossible. There's always a layer of tears behind the lens. It may feel like that's the case because it's so excruciatingly painful. But let's make an important clarification here. Not all the gas that you see at protests are actually tear gas. In DC, for example, our crews retrieved these canisters of Olaricin's capiscum, or OC for short. Joan says that's the scientific name for pepper spray. So pepper spray, the oil-based one, could potentially be soaked up by the contact lens and then held against your eye. So that might make a slight difference. And other doctors agree. Dr. Ravi Gold, the spokesperson for the American Academy of Ophthalmology, told us that these lenses could act as a reservoir, holding in those fumes. So the headline is this, contacts may keep those painful toxins in your eye for longer, but our experts say these online rumors are false. Wearing contacts are not gonna cause blindness. Now we wanna hear from you. If you've got a question that you want verified, just send us an email at verify at wusa9.com.